with the orc molotov there to try and stop the push but it won't be doing too much on that front because emor has gone in for the first entry and Zataris is up close and he's delivering with more frags already up to 11 in total as we just move towards the latter was there or thereabouts but some of the frags that emo got those two kills he got in mid for example a couple of rounds ago oh, were just yeah mind-blowing like they were two completely different angles speaking of him he gets the kill on madden slightly okay. through the wall they do have those saved weapons to work with i say that one of the weapons will be taken care of and a 5-7 from zantaris and a scout from Woxic to answer back Woxic with yet another kill with the scout and a third as well what is going on Madden's still alive, still got a chance, but 9 HP to his name, and he gets blown up from Centares. It would be uh, tunnels, and this time around, is he going to find another one? Yes, is the answer, as a danger man for the side of Ents will fall. And how much more can Emo do here by himself? Like, he's just having so much impact. That's a great grenade. Sped and Zantarez softening him up through the smoke, but it will not stop Dha from connecting the headshot. The flash is good, what? and Emo's picked up another two! This guy cannot miss right now! I have no idea how Emor gets the second one. That's just a ridiculous hate. He's walking in through the smoke, trying to be cheeky, leaving it all on Snappy. The captain in a 1v4. So much done, but just moving around right now. He's going to be heading towards T-spawn, coming up towards mid, looking to cut off rotation, looking to gather information. What? As walks in. What was that? And Ents really started to step up. Those shots not connecting. Looked on, but Hades is going to get punished from Woxic, the leading tower of Turks. It's going to be haunting the Nightmares events. He's still alive here towards LT. He's going to get one. Sprays in for a second and spills the bomb down. As has so often been the case, Emor comes out clutch when it's required. And Madden is going to get pincered and overwhelmed. Spinks in a one on five. Molly tossed in, bomb spilled out, and there's Woxic. We head to OT. Emor spawn için kullanacak bunu. Sonra dönecek tekrar keleşine. Acaba yakalayabildi mi? Smoke'dan güzel bir flick attı. İlk yarı Hades atmıştı aynısını. Imor bir kez daha flickle Snap'i yakalıyor uzun da. Deagles though, so need to be a little wary. Zantaris. Not taking too much of damage, he's gonna be okay with that. A1's all around. But so far it's been it's been a very solid start indeed for Eternal Fire, right? Apart from round number two where they allowed Ents to get the bomb down. Okay, just a wide swing. Hello, Hades. And good night. This entire special oh. three kills, all headshots. <laughs> a man possessed, a man aggressive, and Kalex though will stand his ground. Valiantly sweeps the side two, giving Woxic a chance now to clutch the rest as he goes round the silos. Should get the back many times yet. This happened. Here comes a hit from Ents. Kalex has done so much though in these rounds, and now Emo in a different angle spins around, permits him for two on a swivel, turrets in, and we'll be dropping down another kill to Emo. Three frags will be where he is put to rest. And now Kalex and X Floud, who had so many big rounds on that CT side, have to go above and beyond once more. How many times do we see Eternal Fire successfully retake the B site? Sphinx in the meanwhile though will finalize onto Kalex who was low. And now X Floud at least has the bomb plant for his position, but they must expect this one as the spray is in, and neither of them were checking Decon. That is an area certainly weighs back into this half. This Woxic who goes down first. There is the M4. There is the M4 twice. And a third time as well from Zantares as he terminates all the oncoming T's. Him down. Emo tries to go in for two, but it's only one. And now Zantares has been split apart as well. Woxic no. missing a very important shot. Gets the second though. Now D has less to lie. He knows he's on the site and just flicks up. No defuse required because Woxic locks it down by himself.